everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my August update. Yes, August update for the experiment that I'm doing with Paula and Amanda. Uh, this was based on our How Many Years series. So we are testing the theory for lip products, blush, highlighter, and eyeshadow. And yeah, this is, this is August update. I'm going to tell you what day we are on because um, it's very helpful to know what day we are on. For August 11th, we are on day 223. Yeah, we're really far into this project. So let's start with blush because, you know, it hasn't changed at all. And it's not going to change for months because I decided to Franken everything. So what I'm about to show you is the only blush that I have left in the experiment. But um, I did put in 400 days worth. Why? I don't know. I don't know why I put that much in because I'm crazy, I guess. Um, as of right now, and it was the same as the last update, I have finished 138.31 days. Far cry from the 223 that we're at right now, but let me show you what I have left. It is in this pan. I have made a little bit of progress in it. It was very domed before and it's pretty flat now and you can actually see where it's starting to wear down in certain areas. So, you know, I'm just gonna keep on working on that one. What else can I do? It's the only blush I have in right now. Let's get on to the highlighters. The highlighters. My big worry for the whole thing. That is still the same. I am at 120.906 days, so almost 121 days at 223. What are you going to do? Um, I will show you what I have left of the um, Benefit What's Up that I dug out of the base. That is the tiniest little bit, and um, hopefully that will be done by the next update. So I'm just going to keep working on that, and I did it solely for this experiment. I have the Tarte Sparkler. I almost said the lip paint, but no, that's in my lip stuff. This is what I have left of the Tarte Sparkler. Yeah, I've got good pan in there. And um, this is actually going pretty quick. Um, when Yana sent this to me, it was shattered, so I had to repress it. And I guess I didn't repress it as firmly as it came originally. So it's actually going quicker than I thought it would. So but I'm not mad at that because I have plenty of highlighters. I also have the blush highlighter from e.l.f. in Got A Glow. That's what I have left of that one. This one is not currently in any projects, but I have a feeling next month I'm probably going to um, put this in, go for the goal if I have, you know, if I'm able to put it in so that I can have some variety in my highlight. And the Bare Minerals Gold Gossamer, or Rose Gossamer, that I have not touched at all yet, and I'm not going to touch this until the other two are done, because I want to at least finish whatever I can possibly finish before I start working on that one. I've got a, a hair on my lip. Dog hairs. He's right behind me, again. I swear, whenever his daddy is not home, he's like right there on top of me. Does anybody else's dogs do that, or is it just a German Shepherd thing? I don't know. Um, all right, moving on to the lip products, because um, I would save the eyeshadow for last, because eyeshadow is crack. You guys know it. I know it. The whole world knows it. Um, I put in seven or 700, no, 374.91 days, so roughly 375 days. Currently, right now, I am at... You ready for this? 571.318 days. Because I'm using a lot of other stuff. I've been layering and using um, more lip balms than I originally put in, lip liners and such. I'm going to give you the number minus the extras. If I'm only talking about the stuff that is in project or in the experiment, I'm at 131.189 days. But I have some products that I'm going to show you that have a lot of usage on them and they're going to be done very, very soon. One of them is going to be done any day. So 
that will change the numbers drastically. The one that's going to be done any day is the Tarte Tardis Lip Paint. I, I don't know how much more I can scrape out of there. I don't know if you can see that the sides are pretty darn bare as much as I can scrape out. So yeah, this is going to be gone any day, any day. And this one, this is the Makeup Forever Artist Rouge C211 that is busted. It's, it's getting lower and lower. I mean, there's still some there, but I don't think it's going to take too awful long, especially once the lip paint is done. I do have another Artist Rouge C211 that is brand new that I have not started yet. <clears throat> I have two full-size Buxom lip glosses. I just started working on Raquel, and it was laying on its side, so I don't know that there's a ton of progress on it. I just started using it this week, so, you know. I also have the Lorac Alter Ego Lip Gloss in Goddess. I've used this a few times, but um, I don't think it's going to take that long because it's kind of tiny, and the last two Sephora Colorista lipstick pans. Those are gonna be done. I am pretty daggone sure that both of these Sephora Colorista lipstick pans are gonna be done by the next update. This one is absolutely gonna be done. The Tarte Tardis lip paint will be done. So definitely three things will be done. I don't know if the Artist Rouge C211 will be done, but it'll be very close like down to the base, I'm thinking, if it's not completely done. And the lip gloss, we'll just have to wait and see how that um, pans out. Yeah, I know I'm corny, but um, yeah, I'm not worried about the lips at all because I have a lot that's gonna be tallying up for the next update. So I'm good, I'm good on the lips. That's not a ton left as far as lip products and I feel confident in it. All right, moving on to the eyes. Let me scroll to that tab on my spreadsheet. I put 375.413 days in. We are at, what did I say, 223, day, 220, day 223. Um, I have finished 315.721 days worth. But that's not all in the project because you guys know I like to multitask. So let me give you the breakdown of what is in this um, experiment, not project, experiment. <clears throat> so as far as the experiment is concerned, I have finished 129.314 days. But I have a lot to show you. A lot to show you. Let me put those back in because... I don't want to screw up my spreadsheet here. All right. This is one of my quads that is in there. I've got this Franken in here and then this silver here. I've got a ton of usage on all of those. And none of these, none of these pans count yet because they're all in the Franken or still in here. So I'm thinking... I don't think I can have these done by the next update, but um, this one, this one's got the evil shades, uh, what is that, Heartless Queen in it. That one's going to be done. Um, let's see. I don't think I'm going to have that one done, but I should have pan on that one. I've got these two in here, plus a dog hair. Um, those, I don't know. I don't know that I can get those done. I don't know. Probably not. Um, the Kaylin Orchid, probably not going to be done, but some major pan. This one was huge. I actually had to, um, I had more than would fit in this pan. So let me tell you how much was in this one. 0 0.09. So when this one is done, probably in about two months. I'm, I'm hoping by the end of September I can have this done. That's going to be 0 0.09 and that is going to make my numbers just skyrocket. Um, let's see what else do I have. Oh my my homemade smudge pot. This is the Coastal Scents Intergold Sparks. That's what I have left in there. 
This is probably going to take me till the end of September as well. I, I love to use it and I can't get the cap back on. But yeah, it's still there. I haven't even touched this one from Evil Shades. This is Elusive. It will get done. As soon as I have a pan to press it in, it's going to get done. This one I'm taking my sweet time on. Another Evil Shades. This is 13th Hour. When I... Ooh, someone's coming in. I right, close the door, sweet pig. Oh, you want to come in? All right, close the door. My daughter... All right, the Coastal Scents um, Hot Side Pink Mica. I'm going to hit pan on this baby any day. So, yeah, that one's probably going to be another end of September. And the last two palettes. Um, my e.l.f. Eye Transformer palette. I've got this shade done right here. And this one has some major usage on it. I think I will have this done in September and then... I just really will have these two to work on right here and I'm making really good progress on this one I've got like a nice dip in that one I feel good about that and my elf mad for matte palette let me show you where I am with that one I've got major usage I did franken this shadow and it has overflowed to here but they're not packed tightly so I don't think they're gonna take too long so it looks like an eye, a lot of eyeshadow to um, the vast majority of people, but um, I don't I don't feel like it's a problem for me. I really don't. I like my color. I like I, I'm not light-handed with eyeshadows by any stretch of the imagination. I mean, look at this crazy color on my eyes. I, I'm not shy with eyeshadow at all, so I'm not worried about this. I'm not worried. So. I, I have maintained since the very beginning the only thing that I am truly worried about is the highlighters and that was not our equation that was the one we got off of reddit everything else was kind of formulated between myself and Yana and Amanda and a little help tweaking final numbers with Paula on a couple of them so you know it, it is what it is but we will see what next month holds for us I have a feeling I'm gonna have a lot more done by the next update I really do um, there's so much that's close that I think my numbers are gonna start jumping except the highlighter and the blush with the lips and the eyes yeah you're gonna see some big changes in my numbers all right I'm gonna wrap this up of course I'm gonna have Amanda and Paula down there in the description box I should have links to um, the spreadsheets if you guys want to figure out how many years you have the, all the equations and stuff like that and if I remember, I'm going to have Corey side. She did this years ago. Um, her equations were a little bit different, but she, same basic concept. So I'm going to have her link down there. And if I can find the Reddit link again, I, I know I had it somewhere. I will put that down. Both Paula and Amanda are going to be at the end of my video. So you can just click right on their faces and go to their channels. See how they're doing with theirs? Who knows? All right, I'm going to wrap this up because my, my daughter is right here. And she wants to hang out with her little baby and her wild hair. I don't know where she gets that. All right. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until I see you on my next video, have a beautiful day. Hi, baby. You smell like pretzels. Can you say bye to everyone? Bye-bye.